UW-Whitewater has an area of study for everyone, from business to theater and everything in between. There's also an abundance of activities and clubs for students to explore and enjoy. However, there's one area of study that a lot of students might not know about, the Japanese studies major. It falls under the Department of Languages and Literatures in the College of Letters and Sciences. The Japanese studies major is described by its students as fun but also challenging. The goal of the Japanese classes here at UW-Whitewater is to help students improve on speaking skills. Not only that, but Japanese writing skills are heavily emphasized as there are three different Japanese writing systems. Students in the Japanese studies major are required to study abroad for at least one semester, with others choosing to spend an entire school year abroad. Students can participate in study abroad programs at Sofia University in Tokyo and Kansai Gaidai University in Osaka. And I chose to study abroad at Sofia University in Tokyo. And it was pretty cool, but the lifestyle there is definitely different than a place like Whitewater. <laughs> Uh, like commuting every day was kind of a struggle and um, the classes at the university there were definitely more tough than at Whitewater. In addition, there's a Japanese language club for students who want to learn the language better. Every Monday is language day where the students study the Japanese language. Every Wednesday is Culture Day, where students learn more about the different facets of Japanese culture. It's kind of more for the more dedicated students to the language because on Mondays we kind of go over our vocabulary and the grammar we've gone over. It kind of really helps us prepare for tests and such. If you're interested, the Japanese Language Club meets on the second floor of Highland Hall on Mondays and Wednesdays from 5 to 6 p.m. For more information about the Japanese Studies program, contact Marjorie Ryan, the Japanese Studies Coordinator.